Andrew McGahan for Severe MMA, and I'm standing alongside Sean Cogan. Sean, uh, was that your first fight under the CMAC banner? Under the CMAC banner, yeah. And fighters say that often they're in a rut, they want to change things up. What was your reason for leaving Kakaro? Uh, I just felt four years in the one gym, I felt like I've improved by going elsewhere. So what, what have you noticed in your improvement? Um, even mostly the, in my mind, I feel more confident about being able to use my skills to the fullest. You improved as the fight went on. Your striking in the first looked very good, but it looked even better in the second. Were you hoping it would be a stand-up fight? You see, I had a Jaffa cake just beforehand that fucked up my stomach. So by the time I was out there, I was like, oh, I'm going to have to let this go to the second because I don't feel good right now. So see, it was just like, survive this for us now. feel good and we'll take him on the second. And it was a stitch or what was it? Yeah, that's, and it, kind of just, it felt weird. I felt that. And I was like, fuck. Looked like there was a battle of uh, footsie going on as well during the fight. What, what was going on there? He was looking for an ankle lock, but... I wouldn't talk to an ankle lock. Why not? Uh, they're only pain in the Achilles lock. It's only pain in the tendon and the nerves. And I feel like it's not going to break anything when we top. So you, you mentioned something about in your mind about what you think that's the biggest improvement. Just give us, I know Luke and uh, the Cochrane's big judo background, so they'd have a competitive mindset. Is yeah. that, that what you mean? Yeah, and I always felt like I had the skills, but when it came to this, I couldn't fully use them. I felt like tonight I didn't. I felt maybe not me 50%. Only 50, so there's more to come in the future? Yeah, I really believe so. And Only 19 now, and this is me 8 for you. And when are you hoping to be back out again? Uh, April. April? Yeah. And uh, one final thing, your teammate, uh, Scobie. Yeah. I've heard a lot about him. How do you think he's going to do tonight? I think he's going to win, I think he's going to finish him. I fought Alex, too, his opponent. I think Scobie will be too big, too good. He's going to do it. The entrance music's on now, so we'll let you go check out your thing there. Thank you very much, Sean. We appreciate Thank it. Thank you.